Hello Green Style fans! Um, today I'm going to be showing you how to attach the triangular gusset. Um, I'm going to be using the Lucy Leggings pattern and I've posted a separate blog post for how to adjust your Lucy Leggings pattern to accommodate a gusset. I really like the triangular gusset because I feel like it's easy to install and gives you a good range of movement. Um, for this tutorial you're going to need your two leggings pieces. Um, now the Lucy's are all one piece so you're just going to need those. If you're using a leggings pattern um, that has a side seam like the Inspires you'll just need your back pieces to start out with. And then you'll need to cut two of the um, gusset pieces and baste them together wrong sides together. Okay so what we're going to start out by doing is just attaching this gusset to the back. So I'm going to place it along the edge of the back rise and I'm going to serge it on. Now I'm going to start with um, no seam allowance right here, just a quarter inch seam allowance, not cutting anything off of my serger and then I'm going to go to a 3 8 inch seam allowance once I get to the top edge of the gusset. So I'm going to go ahead and serge that on and then I'll come back and show you how to put the other piece in. Okay, so I'm over here at my serger and I've got my gusset placed right along that bottom edge. Sometimes I'll just give it a clip or two just to help hold it in place. So I am going to start up at the top, not cutting anything off with my serger. And then once I get to the top of the gusset, I'm gonna start to remove my seam allowance, so making it 3 8 Okay, so now I've got the gusset sewn in on one side. I'm going to go back down to my cutting table and show you how I clip in the other side, getting ready to attach the other back piece to the gusset. So I have my gusset that I've sewn in here to one back piece, or one side of the back, and then I'm gonna grab my other leggings piece and place the back right sides together with that first piece. I'm gonna give it a couple clips at the top and at the very bottom. And then I'll flip it over so you can see what's happening here. So you can see um, that I need to line this up a little bit better. And also that this seam allowance here, I usually kind of flip it like that. Okay, and you'll notice that there's a little gap at the very top of your gusset. That's nothing to worry about. Um, when you serge this on with the 3 8 inch seam allowance, that's just going to go away. So now I'm going to go back over to my serger and I'm going to start at the bottom here and I'm going to serge my way up um, and then I'll come back and I'll show you what that looks like on the gusset. So I've got my leggings underneath my serger here. This time I'm going to do the whole thing with the 3 8 inch seam allowance starting right at the bottom of the gusset. And I'm just kind of making sure that the gusset stays lined up as much as possible with the edge of the other back piece. Got my extra threads here, there we go. So you can see that that formed a nice V there and if I turn them right sides out you'll see how nice that looks. Now this piece up here is going to get attached to the front of the legging. So I'm going to take you down to the cutting table and show you what that looks like. In preparation for this next step I've sewn my front rise here, serged it. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to open them up and place the front on top of the back. And I'm going to take the center front and I'm going to line it up with the tip of the gusset. Okay, you can place a little clip there. Now because this is the Lucy leggings and these are all one piece, I don't need to sew the side seams. But if you did need to sew the side seams, you would usually do that first and then work on the gusset. So I'm just going to clip 
the slide closed and I'm going to sew all the way up one leg across the gusset and down the other. Okay, straight down the other. So that's it. Then your gusset is installed and you can continue with constructing and finishing your leggings as normal, working on the waistband and the hem. And you will have a beautiful triangular gusset. So I'm gonna go do that and then I'll come back and show you what it looks like and then you'll be all done. So that's it. You should have your leggings turned right side out. If you look at the gusset, um, you'll see it makes a nice V in the back um, and then comes together in the front with the front piece. Um, it's pretty low profile when you're putting them on. You shouldn't even see the gusset. Um, so it'll be kind of down in the middle so it'll look more like that. Um, and you've installed the triangular gusset. So I'd love to know what you think. Um, do, did you like that construction method? Did it feel easy? Were there any tricky parts? Um, drop me a comment and let me know and enjoy sewing your leggings.